you are listening to the voice of the gospel a proclamation of the holy scripture by wisdom ministries march 15th monday let's begin this day with the blessings of god a reading from the holy gospel according to saint john chapter 4 verses 43 to 54 When the two days were over he went from that place to Galilee for Jesus himself had testified that a prophet has no honor in the prophet's own country when he came to Galilee the Galileans welcomed him since they had seen all that he had done in Jerusalem at the festival for they too had gone to the festival then he came again to cana in galilee where he had changed the water into wine now there was a royal official whose son lay ill in capernaum when he heard that jesus had come from judea to galilee he went and begged him to come to down and heal his son for he was at the point of death then jesus said to him unless you see signs and wonders you will not believe the official said to him sir come down before my little boy dies jesus said to him go your son will live the man believed the word that jesus spoke to him and started on his way as he was going down his slaves met to him and told him that his child was alive so he asked them the hour when he began to recover and they said to him yesterday at one in the afternoon the fever left him the father realized that this was the hour when jesus had said to him your son will live so he himself believed along with his whole household now this was the second sign that jesus did after coming from judea to galilee the gospel of the lord praise the lord jesus christ dear friends This week we begin a semi continuous reading of uh, John's gospel. Today Jesus brings a promise of new life and now and in the future. Today's gospel follows immediately on the encounter of Jesus with the uh, Samaritan woman. Jesus now goes back to Galilee from uh, Samaria in spite of what Jesus had said earlier about prophets not being welcomed in their own place. he was received well because they had seen what jesus had done in jerusalem during his recent visit there he returns to cana where he had performed his first sign changing water into wine a high official comes to ask jesus to cure his son who is dying jesus first reaction is negative he complains of people just looking for miracles signs and wonders the man ignores jesus remarks and repeats his request for jesus to come and heal his son before he dies this it in itself indicates the level of a man's faith in jesus christ this is always a basic requirement for healing to take place jesus ignores the invitation to go to the man's house in the synoptics It is the centurion who tells Jesus it is not necessary to go to his house. There was because he was a, a gentile and knew that Jesus should not go there. Here Jesus simply says, "Go home, your son will live." The man believed what Jesus said and set forth for his home. Before he gets home, the official servants are coming out to tell him that his son is alive and well on further inquiries the father learns that the fever subsiding just at the moment when jesus promised that the boy would live it was also the moment when the man trusting in jesus word began his own journey towards his home john tells us that This is the second and the seventh sign that Jesus did. Yes, my dear friends, it's clear message is that Jesus brings life, eternal life that brings now. In John, eternal life begins as soon as we were attach ourselves in total trust to Jesus and to his way. Lent is a good time for us 
to renew our bloods to walk along his way and to ask for a deep level of faith to do so. And the last words of this, this gospel, we see the, this is the second sign that Jesus did. The seven signs in John here are first one, the changing of water into wine at the marriage feast in Cana, chapter 2, verse 1 to 11. The healing of the royal official son, chapter 4, verse 46 to 54. The healing of a man who is crippled at the bedside of the pool, chapter 5, verse 1 to 18. Feeding the 5,000, chapter 6, verse 1 to 15. Jesus walking on the water, chapter 6, 16 to 21. Healing of the man born blind, chapter 9, verse 1 to 41. And the seventh one, the raising of Lazarus, Jesus' friend. Chapter 11, verse 1 to 40, 44. Amen. May God bless us.